your name, your testimony, and make it brief, sir. Hallelujah. My name is Dickin Radcliffe Ganda. I'm from Winners Chapel in Indianapolis, Indiana, and I am the Dickens Chairman. Amen. On the 18th of August, I took the Pfizer vaccine, and Wednesday, the following day, I was supposed to give the word for midweek service. I couldn't because I was having fever, so I talked to Pastor Nelson, and he did it for me. A um, couple of days after, I ended up in the emergency hospital, and then I was admitted. Um, two days after I was admitted, the doctor came up to me and told me the process that I have to go to. And the last option was to go to the ventilator. And they said, if we put you to the ventilator, there's a possibility that you will die. You will not make it. As he was talking, I started getting angry in my spirit. And I started boiling up. So I told him, after he's finished talking, I said, I leaned, I leaned forward and I said, doctor, I say, I heard what you said. I know the pros and cons of everything. I said, but this is what's going to happen. Even if I go through the ventilator, I will not die. I said, but I'm not doing it. And so we stayed on that for a couple of days. On the 31st of December, they came and they said, we have to put you through the ventilator. And I said, is that all? They said, yes. I said, okay, I'm done. We're done with the treatment. I'm going home. They thought I was joking, but I wasn't. So I called Pastor Nelson and my other friend. And Pastor Nelson came to the hospital. Long story short, I ended up staying. But before Pastor Nelson left, he called Pastor Isaac. And Pastor prayed with me over the phone. And he said, there shall be no loss. And I tapped into that. And I laid on the bed and I said, you guys do what you want to do. And I asked him, I said, if you put me through the ventilator, how soon will I get up? They said, a couple of hours. I said, okay, good. So I expected to get up at in the evening hours. Long story short, I got up 93 days after. The doctors did everything. They said everything in the books. And all the results came back negative. They told my family to prepare for my funeral in three days. They found some of, some of my friends, contacted the, the mortuary and everything. They were planning everything. But to God be the glory, when everything failed, Jesus showed up. Jesus showed up. Jesus showed up. Glory to God. I'm here to give him all the glory and to say thanks. Hallelujah. Somebody appreciating our God of wonders. Put your hands together for Jesus.